Hey guys, it's Retro Extreme 79 back with my latest pickup video since my last video. Uh, I'm going to show you guys what I picked up since my previous video. So, um, yeah, without further ado, let's just jump into it, shall we? Alright, so let's start off with this right here, this little bundle here. Move that to the side, you probably already saw what it is, but let's get to this right now. I got this stack actually today, and this right here... I saw this in the uh, CD, uh, old uh, tape cassette aisle, and it's a Nintendo DS case. It says 390. So, um, alright, so then I opened it up. Let's see, I can open it up with one hand. And it had two games in there. It had uh, the one on the left, this Pets Rescues Wildlife Vet. The second one is uh, Zuzu. Pets 2, the Wild Bunch. So, um, you know, with the two games inside in the case, 390, you can't beat that. So I had to pick it up. This little stack here was 190. This right here is no TV show, and I'm sure a lot of the old gamers remember it, um, as well as I do. Here is Welcome Back Cotter with John Travolta there on the uh, bottom left hand corner. It, and it's actually. Uh, it's kind of new because it's got the tape and it's missing the plastic, but uh, like, see, it, it, you can't open it because of the top portion. So it's kind of new, I guess, but 190, you can't beat that. And then the rest are all games uh, for Xbox for a 190. Picked up Trivial Pursuits Unhinged. Good condition. And uh, it's complete, as you can see. And yeah, 190 for that. Picked up another Xbox game, a game called Scaler. Looks like a pretty fun game. Um, haven't played either one of the two games, but this one especially looks pretty fun. And um, yeah, also paid a buck ninety for that, and it's complete in good shape. Last pickup I got from the thrift store today, a regular PS1 game that I also paid a buck ninety for. I know Blockbuster uh, game that is Tomb Raider: The Last Revelation. And uh, this is right here. This right here is not the manual, the, the front booklet or whatever. This they cut off from the actual, um, I guess they cut it off from the manual actually, now that I think about it. Let me see. Uh, Alright. There it is. But uh, yeah, this right here, I have to pull it out. It's just like a piece of cardboard, I think. Oh, yeah, no, you see, it's like they cut it out from the actual manual or the booklet and they slid it in here when they were uh, when they were running the game out a long time ago. So, anyways, yeah, and that was all a buck ninety, a buck ninety each. All right, so there we go. There's that little stack. Next up, yesterday I uh, picked up just one thing that I found at another thrift store the Sega Genesis Turbo Controller. He's got the buttons there. Uh, automatic, turbo, normal, and slow motion. See, they got the, all the buttons there. Yeah, it looks like a standard Genesis controller, but uh, yeah, it's a turbo controller. And for this, I paid a uh, dollar ninety for that. So that was pretty cool. Happy to get that. And then last week, um, I picked up a few things. This, this right here is going to be non-gaming related, but I had to pick it up. It's an old, uh, an old hat. DC hat and it's one of these fitted hats ah I paid 390 for that so that was pretty cool I had to pick that up just just because you know okay so that's pretty cool all right uh, what should I show next okay let's so every thrift store is different when it comes to pricing items uh, games um, etc books um, I was fortunate enough to get this stack right here for 20 cents each. Check it out. And probably at another thrift store would have been a lot more per book or magazine. Look at that. I got Pokemon, um, the the uh, official Pokemon guide, and um, it's for hard, ah, hard gold version and soul, silver version. I had these games a while back, but I sold them. Uh, I sold them to somebody that really wanted them. But, um... I didn't know I was gonna obviously pick this up, but that would have been sweet if I still had the games to go with the this manual. But yeah, so this was twenty cents. I mean, 
regular price is 20 bucks. This is pretty, it's pretty thick. Look at that. It's got so many pages, but I was happy to get that. Another uh, guide I got for 20 cents, kind of similar. It's the uh, the official Pokemon full Pokedex guide, volume 2. Um, as you can see there, it's pretty, another thick book. Look at this. Look how thick it is. This was 20 cents as well. And this was another about $20 as well. So, yeah. Those two were 20 cents each. And then I got a few Nintendo Powers. I mean, they, they unfortunately, they were not from the NES, SNES era. But they're more from the Wii era. But that's still cool for 20 cents. I couldn't pass it up. So, here we go. Issue this one. It's going to be from uh, Sonic Secrets right here. So that, yeah, that's pretty cool. I'm, I probably got about maybe close to 100 Nintendo Powers by now. I used to be a subscriber. Uh, and and I, I don't have none of these issues too, by the way. I got none of these. Here's another one. Um, we the Sims. As you can see there, like I said, they are more from the um, Wii era. And again, 20 cents a piece, that's a good deal. Because normally these go for um, a lot more... Uh, per issue, and it's even more per uh, bundle. There's Knights of the Journey of the Dreams. Just do a quick, uh, you know, run through the game right there. See? Okay. Next up, I got a Zelda cover. We Dream of Zelda. Here we go. Obviously, somebody subscribed to it. <laughs> and, um,. Yeah, it's got all, look at this little Pokemon thing there, Kirby, yeah, so this one is like a little more thicker, this book, it's interesting, it's always good to go back and read some of these old issues here, guys, I love Nintendo, grew up on Nintendo, and yeah, <laughs> I'm just happy to have this, alright, next one, Nintendo Wi-Fi Connection, alright, it's got Mario Kart there, Tony Hawk, let's, let's do a quick, uh, looks like a little calendar from 06, from seven years ago. Alright. And then the last issue I got, there were six total. Soul Calibur Legends. Okay. And these are in really good shape. I mean, they're not bad at all. Only one of the Pokemon guys was a little bit rough from the front cover. But other than that, I mean, the, the Pokemon books, the guides, and then the magazines here, the, these are in really good shape. So every single issue I showed you was 20 cents each. And lastly, um, I got a couple of uh, Game Boy games that were half off, so I paid a buck ninety-five for these games. So I picked up, um, and the sticker's still on there, um, three ninety. But again, I paid one ninety-five for it. It was half off. WWF Superstars Two. You can see Hulk Hogan, The Undertaker. So I'm a big wrestling fan, so you all know that, you know. So. Happy to get that. And the last game I picked up, and the last thing I want to show you for this video, another Game Boy game that I paid $1.95 for. Oh, you already saw it. Paperboy. So yeah, these two games were a buck ninety-five each. So yeah, that's pretty much all my pickups for this newest video. I'm happy to share this with you guys. Uh, please like the video, thumbs up it. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so already. Um, you know, I, I really appreciate the subs and the support. And, uh, you know, I just want to thank you guys for stopping by. Um, take care. Have a good day. And I'll see you all next time.